What's up, it's Josh Hewitt from Top Form Fitness and in this video I wanted to go through a home workout version of my minimalist training program. So we'll be covering uh, most of the major muscle groups in the body with just three exercises, but we're going to be using primarily body weight exercises given that uh, with the COVID lockdown a lot of people don't have access to gyms. So using a few simple accessories which you could pick up on Amazon, we're going to go through three exercises including a lunge variation, an inverted row variation and a push-up variation. So we're just going to finish up the warm-up here and get right into it. So the first exercise of the circuit is a reverse lunge with knee lift. Now I've had a few requests to record an entire workout from start to finish. So we're starting off here with the warm-up set. One of the challenges with body weight only exercises is that you can't just simply pick up weight or put weight down to increase or decrease the difficulty. So you need to manipulate other variables uh, to make it harder or easier such as changing the speed of the movement, uh, changing the angle, or by simply choosing a slightly more challenging or less challenging variation of the exercise. So with this lunge variation I'll be increasing the difficulty for the working sets by moving into a power lunge where I actually jump off of the ground explosively with each repetition. Each exercise will be performed in the 10 to 15 repetition range aiming to reach fatigue in the last couple of circuits. Now moving on to the inverted row. We're starting here at an easier angle for the warm-up set uh, giving us some space to increase the difficulty by changing the angle in the subsequent working sets. I'm using suspension straps here similar to the TRX or the Jungle Gym straps which you can purchase online uh, on Amazon as well. I believe there are several different variations and they can be also hooked uh, above a door frame using a, a door anchor or on a door mounted chin-up bar or even hanging onto a tree or monkey bars if you're training outside. Now moving on to just standard push-ups. If you find regular push-ups to be too challenging for a warm-up set, you can start with knee push-ups or do incline push-ups off of a desk or a counter. Now we're moving on to the first working set of the power lunge. So here I'm trying to push off the ground in each repetition which significantly increases the difficulty of the exercise. If you do have access to suspension straps, which I demonstrated with the inverted row, you can also perform different single leg exercise variations for the lower body such as the assisted pistol squat which I'm showing in the upper right hand corner. With the working set of the inverted row I'm now moving down to a more challenging angle so that I'm basically parallel to the floor. And again, there are other variations to the inverted row that you could perform. Uh, up in the right hand corner here, I'm showing a very similar movement using the equalizer parallel bars or parallel bars. This is another simple training accessory that you can pick up for your home gym that doesn't take up a lot of space. To increase the difficulty of the push-up for my working sets, I'm elevating my feet. This makes the exercise noticeably harder. Uh, you can also slow down the tempo, especially emphasizing the lowering or the negative phase of the exercise to increase the difficulty. If you do have access to suspension straps, you can also perform a suspended push-up as shown in the top right hand corner here, which will make the exercise noticeably more difficult as well.
And now moving on to the third set of each exercise, which is the second last circuit in this workout. And I really want to start challenging myself with these exercises now without sacrificing my form too much. And then on the fourth circuit, the final round of each exercise, I'm going to incorporate a set extension. Take your shot. Take your shot. And now on to the fourth and final set of each exercise. On the last set of each exercise, I'm going to use a drop set. So I'm going to go to complete exhaustion and then finish the exercise with an easier variation so that I can push through several more repetitions. So here I'm doing a stationary lunge after I finish the power lunges. And for the set extension or the drop set with the inverted rows as well as the push-ups, the final two exercises here, I am simply going to be changing the angle of the exercise so that I have a more favorable mechanical advantage to push out several more repetitions once I've already reached fatigue. So here moving from a low angle on the row to a little bit higher angle which is a little bit easier. And it's the same idea for the drop set with the push-ups. I'm performing as many repetitions as I can with my feet elevated. And then as I reach a point of fatigue, I'm moving down to regular floor push-ups, which is a slightly easier exercise variation. And you'll notice here that once I reach fatigue with these, which won't take me very long, I'm pretty exhausted now in the upper body. Then I drop down to squeeze out a few more repetitions from the knees. I hope you found this video helpful and this gives you some ideas for creating your own minimalist home workout. Until next time, stay strong.